Saturday. It's Saturday. Um, off work. Normally, this would be the best moment of my life, but I'm not off yet. I have one more day. Uh, one of the nurses is on vacation, and the mouth got me to work tomorrow. Um, but it's eight hour shift. But anyway, I want to take you guys in a sneak peek really quick. I don't have a lot of time into um, a massive beauty supply store. I need concealer. I need lashes. And I'm going to see if they have anything else. And I'm in the parking lot of Dollar Tree, but I do not have time for Dollar Tree. I'm um, going to a party tonight with the hubs. It's a family gathering. Um, so I don't have time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hugs and kisses for all the well wishes. Y'all know I was sad, y'all. I was sad for a few days about my chunk of moving to Florida. But I'm in a good place. I'm at peace with it. And um, I'm feeling a whole lot better. And thank you for the well wishes. And thank you for my prayers. And if you pray, just keep them in your prayers. That God keeps them safe. And that he continues to be a happy little baby. And that he has everything he needs. And just nothing but well wishes and thank you so let's go we're going into popcorn beauty supply this place is massive you talk about wigs and makeup oh my god massive hi how you doing all of these are 99 cents they don't last that long y'all but if you're looking for a quick accessory you got it right here oh i get so excited when i come into these kind of stores Those lashes. Oh my god. I like Ardell. Hi, how are you? Good. <laughs> Everything's good. Works good. <sighs> Look at this. Oh my God. Look at this. Okay, guys, the video from the beauty supply store. Sorry, I had to speed it up because they play music. So that's going to be a copyright issue for YouTube. And also, if the view is kind of awkward, it's because they have a lot of staff in this beauty supply store. And um, not everybody would like for you to be taping in your their store. You know what I mean? So they don't know who I am. I mean, I could be a competitor or whatever. So I was trying to do it on the low. But you guys from the video should get an idea how massive that beauty supply store is. So I did purchase a wig. Which I will put the review attached to this video. Um, I'm nervous, but I seen a wig similar on YouTube. If you hear noise, it's the foot massager. Because I have to relax these feet before I put on these boots tonight and be walking around. I don't know if they're seating, if we're going to be standing, whatever. Okay. Um, but look at this bag, y'all. Now I said, did you charge me for this? They were giving away free hair. Okay. Um, from the Janet collection, not something spectacular but it's still free and you never know so i'm not going to show you the wig i purchased just yet but i did purchase a wig for forty dollars um 
I did get, um, I love this lotion. This is from Palmer's. It smells so good. This is the olive butter formula with vitamin E, uh, 24 hour moisture. Y'all need to stop lying, Palmer's, but I still love it. It was $5.99, so I needed some more lotion. Ooh, look what they gave. I'll show you the free stuff later. Um, I did pick up this comb, a wide tooth comb, okay, to style wigs. I got these lashes. I love these lashes. These are 100% silk lash, 3D volume lash, and um, I did get these lashes. Um, I picked up a brush palette. Um, you can't see it, but one of them has some gold sparkles in it. This one right here, and it would be great if it would show up. Um, I'm going to try that tonight. Um, and I needed some more concealer. Yeah. So I got the wig and those items. That beauty supply store is massive. I'm telling you. And that's not even all of it. Trust me, guys. I just showed y'all snippets. Okay. Now I'm going to show you the free stuff. Make sure ain't nothing hanging out. As soon as I come home, I get undressed. Okay. So this stuff that I'm showing you now, they were giving away. And one thing about this beauty supply store, almost all the time they have samples, but nothing this big, okay? It's this magazine called Hotline. Um, it's for the Janet collection, and I guess it's their lookbook and their catalog of wigs, braiding hairs, or whatever. So that came. Hold on, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. And this is six packs of braiding hair. It's pre stretched, it's 54 inches. It says perm yakky extra lightweight and this was all free and the color they gave me was 1b it's all 1b okay and i think i may try something with this i don't know when but i think i may try something so i got six packs of hair and this is a really good this is from the janet collection this is a paddle brush and i needed a good wig brush okay and it's my favorite color pink. And this was all free. I didn't pay for none of this, okay? So, um, I'm going to get myself together. And I'm going to show you guys the wig that I purchased. Um, I am going to wear it tonight. I'm nervous because this is something out of my comfort zone. But, hey, you, it is what it is, okay? So, stay tuned. Okay, this is Motown Tress Eldora color 1b30 which is not my first color but they did not have much of a color selection the only other color was this like platinum blonde which i did not want so this is the wig and it has what looks like the faux corn rolls on the side um i don't know so far it doesn't seem um big head friendly it does have two combs and a comb in the back, adjustable straps. Um, here is the faux braided part. Um, something different. I did see a few other, no baby hairs, which I'm surprised that it didn't come with baby hair. So that's why I'm trying to do something with mine on the side that has the faux braids. Um, I did see two wig reviews, but they were longer units, which this is fine for me because I'm not really feeling, um, I really don't like long hair, even though I have a lot of long wigs. Um, they tangle very, very easily. Um, they start to tangle. So I'm going to put this bad boy on after I cut the lace.
cute i'm glad i did not get the platinum blonde because it kind of looks more realistic um with me pulling my edges out and i don't have platinum blonde edges so it would not look that realistic i think it's really cute um i just trimmed the hairs in the front a little bit um, my advice to you is before you put it on your head to maybe fill in the parting spaces with the concealer or foundation or whatever you put in your parting spaces, um, to create that scalp, do it before you put it on your head. In my opinion, um, I did not think this would be big head friendly, but it is because I have on uh, my wig band and I also, um, the first time I put it on, I had unfastened the um, adjustable straps, but now I have the straps going. I think it's cute. It's the perfect length for me. It says that it's 13 inches. Um, it is that soft Swiss lace. It's curling iron safe to 400 degrees, but it curls for days, so I don't know why you would want to curl this. Um, it does come in a 1B teal green, which might must be cute a 1b teal purple a 1b red plum a t27613 which is my color that's that blondish um with like brownish color i guess you guys see me in that color all the time um this is the dark 1b but it does have if i come close up you see now if you want to frame it more to your face you can but i'm not i like the way this looks and um not bad for 40 bucks i mean you know i wish my clearance spot would have had it um and it doesn't look that different from the model um yeah but you know you see the model didn't put any makeup in the parts or anything like that they never do very rare that they do that but um i like it i like it so it's definitely i mean you could wear this anywhere you could wear this to work you could wear this out uh, you could wear this anywhere but just my advice to you is to uh do the concealer before you put it on your head it's just easier um but yeah, Motown Trust, I don't think I have a lot of their units. And that's not just, it's not any specific reason. Um, but um, yeah, this is cute. And I haven't seen this on YouTube. But then again, I haven't looked for it on YouTube either. So 
Um, the ladies that I follow that do wig reviews just haven't reviewed this unit yet. Um, as you can see, you can get lost in that beauty supply store. Um, it's massive. Like I said, I really couldn't tape that much because it's just, uh, you can't tape everywhere. You know, a lot of people don't like cameras in the stores, but I think this is cute. And I hope you like it too. Let me know what you think in the comments.